In the following videos, we're going to talk about rehabbing the rotator cuff, okay? So I'm going to show you some of the common errors that people do when they're trying to exercise the rotator cuff muscles. And then I'm going to show you some of the correct execution and some other exercises which are very useful. Now, what I'm going to show you is essentially what happens when someone does the, this exercise without really thinking about what they're trying to achieve, okay? So if I just kind of do this uh, inwards and outwards rotation without really thinking about what I'm trying to achieve, all I'm doing there, I'm just hurting my rotator cuff. It's not about how much weight you can pull in this exercise. It's, it's about the, uh, the, the speed of the movement and what exactly you're trying to target. People tend to load up the cable machine and they just focus on this inward rotation and trying to really kind of uh, create a, a big movement and, and essentially pull a lot of weight. There's no point in doing that because you're not really strengthening the rotator cuff muscle. You'll be strengthening your forearm and a part of your biceps. The other very common exercise that you see is essentially the same, but from a different angle, okay? So this is another exercise that I think is completely useless, uh, especially if done incorrectly, like the way I'm doing it now, without really thinking about the speed and what I'm trying to achieve. So in order to make the exercise more effective, we're going to use a band, okay? So in the first variation, you're just going to hold onto the band like this and take a couple of steps forwards. So you can create resistance and then from here the goal is to keep the wrist completely straight so don't let the wrist come out too much don't let it go inwards too much okay so keep it nice and straight as much as possible the elbow is nice and tucked in towards the body and then all you're doing here is essentially you're trying to let the band pull you out into external rotation as much as possible. So what's happening at the moment, the band is pulling my arm into the external rotation and my subscap is really having to work here because it's essentially eccentrically contracting, okay? So it's stopping the arm from going all the way back, all right? And this is what we're trying to rehab. So this exercise from essentially when the arm is coming out like this, you'll be targeting the subscapularis main.